Testing, testing. Can you guys hear me now? Well, let's try this again. Welcome in to Behind the Fog. I'm your host, Dabo Hill. You can call me Dab, Dabby, Dabberino. I don't give a shit. This is a late night talk show where we interview DVD content creators. Hopefully everyone's having a wonderful evening. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Yabba dabba doo. People do call me Dabby Daddy. That is fine as well. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful evening. Thank you guys for coming in. Uh, I'd just like to say Happy Pride Month to everyone. I appreciate everything here. I appreciate this month. Uh, my son, he is... Uh, part of the LGBTQ community, so I love and support everyone out there. Or Father Dabby, I'm a priest. Ooh, I'm not a priest. But welcome in, welcome in, guys. Uh, thank you so much for coming in. Um, let's get the show started. Uh, today we we do have a guest. We have Jim here in Perfect Jim. She is amazing. She is a DVD content creator. Uh, we'll be interviewing her and. Yeah, so let's get started. Um, if you guys didn't know, we had a big release this week in the DVD. I can't roll my R's. Um, big week in DVD. We did launch, well not we, DVD community did launch a new chapter. We got Vecna and we got some awesome, awesome D&D content. Before we jump into that uh, and all the fun things that that brings us, I'd like to say uh, uh, BVR or Dead by Daylight's parent company did lay off about 95 people, and I do feel sorry for them, um, especially with some of their success that they had. Uh, great chapter just was launching, and uh, they got hit with a spree of layoffs. Uh, that is unfortunate to everyone. I do wish them the best, and hopefully they can get on their feet pretty well. Welcome in, Teddy. Welcome in. Almighty, thank you. It is a chubby shirt. I freaking love it. Boo layoffs, yeah. I'm part of the tech industry, and I understand how the layoffs hurt. I've been many companies that have had layoffs, so that's never fun. <clears throat> One of the fun things I like to do in my free time is look at the Facebook groups in De Dead by Daylight. They have some funny-ass shit in those. Um, I love to see, uh, I picked out a few different things today to kind of go over and view. So, uh, the first great one I saw here, uh, is I almost choked on my pretzel when the treasure chest tried to eat me. I don't know if you guys have been paying attention, if you guys played the chapter, but they have mimic chests now, and that shit is hilarious. Uh... What does the teddy say? Poop, 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 Everyone, welcome Teddy in. Teddy sure does say poop to poop, 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 poop. Anyway, um, I have a hilarious clip I'll share in a little bit uh, of me getting ate by a a uh, mimic, where I got bugged in there, just bent over, and a Vecna had to slap me silly. To get me going pretty well. Okay. Then this next one here is what's the point of ranked? Like, I can't even de rank if adds nothing to the game. My opinion make it to where you can de rank, and so that only the best can get to the top rank. I don't know why they even call it ranked if it literally everyone can hit the max rank despite skill. Couple things to deep dive. 
Um, just recently, they made it where you can't derank at all. A few months ago, they made it where you can derank. It's not even called ranked. It is called your grade. And all it does is show you how long, you, how much you played. It didn't do anything before it was on there. Uh, DJ, we all understand why you quit playing Dead by Daylight. And it is because you got tired of everyone hitting Eerie One like you. But it's a valid point. Uh, for those that are newer that don't understand what's going on here, it's not really a rank. It's just a survivor grade. It's just about how much time you put into the game. Welcome in, Lord Grapefruit. Okay, let's see what else we got here. This new killer is really making the game unfun right now. I don't think my any killer or perk should remove the abilities to throw down pallets. It's survivor's only defense unless you're running dead hard or something. What do y'all think? <clears throat> First off, I guess they never really played against anyone that has blood favor. Because that's, uh, first off, blocks from pallets from being thrown down. Second off, that, that uh, cooldown is like 37, 40 seconds. Cooldown for Vecna, and it's his best, best skill by far. Um, he's not even that great of a killer. He's mid. In some hands, he's pretty good. Um, people just always do this when a new killer comes out. They always jump in and start talking about how overpowered people are and how they should remove him from the game, yada, yada, yada. It's true. DJ likes to go complain in these groups. Um, but yeah, it is one of those things that it is not the most overpowered. I know they are going to be nerfing it a little bit. That would be fun, where you could have something like that. Where you can just put that pallet up, and uh, it, it's great. I still need to play Vecna. Maybe we'll play some Vecna tonight, guys. Ah, he's not that overpowered. He's a B, B ish killer. He's a lot of fun. Okay, let's. What's next here, guys? Oh, we have a long one here. Well, my time with Vecna was short but fun. The nerfs are already starting, and now I'm going to revert back to an actually viable killer. I think we need to start boycotting killers and even perks that they decide to nerf. If no one ever uses that killer anymore, they'll, they will look at ways to make them playable again and will as flooding their feedback. So this is starting to get my... This is starting to get ridiculous. Um, they're talking about doing one maybe nerf to Mage Hand. Uh, it's not going to kill them completely. They're, they, they might have to work on a couple things. I know there's a lot of killer mains out there that say he needs some attention in some places um one i really think he needs attention to just playing against him is his skeletons he throws out they're pretty fast and you can get a hit on them but you can just duck on those um just like already calling out that a killer is getting nerfed and you're going to stop playing they've been out for three days now or something it's crazy people are crazy killer's too good killer's not good enough so what are y'all thoughts on the new killer? Because I'm deleting the game as we speak. Oh, there we go. Someone else has spoken. The killer is too tough. They are deleting the game because of that. And I think that is it. There we go, guys. Those are some fun little comments that we've seen. That we've had the pleasure of reading. Those comments are hilarious. Um... I just love half the group saying it's killer sighted, half the group saying it's survivor sighted, and everyone argues about everything. I actually had one I was going to post up there. Someone said, this perk has been meta since the beginning of time. It deserves to be deleted from the game and taken out of the meta, and it was dead hard. Dead hard isn't still the best perk out there in the game. It's, it's really easy. Okay, let's try it now. 
And we hear. Can we hear? <laughs> Looks like we can hear now. We hear. Okay. <laughs> um, tell me. Uh, so I'm sorry. You said. Uh, uh, tell, tell me. Tell everyone myself. about yourself. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. So I'm. I'm more of a positive person. Like I try to, um, keep things positive. Um, in life as well as on streaming, and I like to make people smile, make people laugh. You know, try to make people kind of smile and get out of a bad funk. Um, I'm just, uh, it's something that I like to do as a person as well as in my streams. <laughs> oh, that's great. Yes. <laughs> you, you are a very positive person. I love your energy you. that you bring to your stream and any stream I see you in. You're always there supporting people, always being so sweet, so caring, so 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 nice and i just love it i love seeing the energy you bring to everyone and just the smiles you put on everyone's faces you're an awesome wonderful person you know it's, thank you it, it, that's that's the thing i love like you've been a part of my community for a while now and that's the thing i love to do as well is come in make people feel welcomed just show that love and support you know yeah. And have that positivity, especially here in in Dead by Daylight. There's a lot of you know a lot of toxicity, a lot of people spreading hate and just everything. And streaming together, streaming all together. There's a lot of like just hatred and just like trying to just make yourself better than everyone else and just like superior, uh, superior, uh, just like just people out there just being assholes a lot. And it's it's nice right. and refreshing to see people actually out there like caring and being a positive influence out there. And like, I have little kids in the gaming like space and I want them to look up to people like yourself, you know, that can show that positivity that can have the fun interactions and just be sweet and just kind, you know, you not to be an asshole or just rage or all this stuff, you know, you can, have a great impact on the streaming community. So uh, that's one of the reasons I did choose you um, is that our communities align real well together. Um, you're that positive influence, which we're, I'm looking for. And I want to spread the love and show greater audience who you are and who your community is and how great you guys are. So, Thank you know, you. I, I really appreciate you coming on here and hanging out with us and for us all to get a better chance to get to know you a little bit more. Thank you. I, I'm honored to be here. So ah, thank you. <laughs> you're very welcome. You're very welcome. Um, how did you get into streaming? So a friend of mine actually introduced me to Twitch in 2016. I had never known about Twitch and she introduced me and I started watching a few streamers. I went to my first Twitch con and after I was there and I met so many amazing people, I started to do it myself. And I was initially a variety streamer. I just played my favorite games. And then um, I was introduced to Dead by Daylight in 2017. And then I just basically started streaming that only. I, I do stream other games sometimes, but that's mostly what I what I stream. What are the, I, I know, uh, I know uh, you weren't probably prepared for this, but what other games did you stream before Dead by Daylight? Uh, Okami, um, Rocket League, um, and like recently, uh, Disney Dreamlight Valley. Just Disney Dreamlight Valley is fun. You can carry yeah. DJ and Disney Dreamlight Valley <laughs> and Rocket League. He'll hey. appreciate it. Yeah, I I really like Rocket League, but I I'm not good at it, so I kind of you'll carry DJ. <laughs> you'll carry DJ. That's one of his favorite games. I got you, DJ. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Yeah. Who are some people you look up to in the streaming industry? I. I, you know, it's kind of funny. Um, I was trying to think about that and I actually look up to a lot of the smaller streamers. Um, mm -hmm. I know a lot of people look up to a lot of the partner streamers, which is great. And I do too, but I feel like I, I there's more of a community. I mean, there's communities with the bigger streamers, of course, mm -hmm. but uh, I really like the smaller streamers because I feel like we're more family mm -hmm. oriented. And, you know, of course I support all my friends. But I, I just look up to a lot of a lot of people. There's too probably too many to name right now. Of but I, I definitely look up to a lot. I look up to, up to you as well because you're just you know such a great streamer and you know the whole thing about being positive and you're you're just really good at this game and <laughs> you know and it's it's so amazing to watch you and I watch a whole lot of other people and you know they all inspire me to be uh, not only a better streamer but a better person. That is awesome. That is the yeah. way to be, you know, just always find those, like, those, 
that light that, you know, makes you brighter and, you know, helps mm -hmm. you learn and everything. It, yeah. It's just great to have that opportunity and, you know, to get to know so many people. Like, I, I remember when I started this journey, um, DJ actually got me into Dead by Daylight and... I enjoyed it a lot. I was really shitty at Survivor. I still am kind of shitty at Survivor. Same. But, <laughs> uh, but uh, I got into Killer and I really liked it. And me and DJ were talking about me streaming. And then I just like ordered a webcam for my PS5. And I just started streaming and I had a lot of fun. Met so many fun people. There's so many great yeah. people in this community that I just want to share with everyone. Because it's great. You learn so much from each other. Um, not even with streaming, but with Game Instead. Yeah, for sure. Uh, you also remember that first time I streamed, uh, I streamed Bill, um, and we were going up against a trapper, and I stepped in like 17 traps. I got off a trap <laughs> and then ran right into another one. Oh, man. Sounds like me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I still do that. <laughs> Don't we all? Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, I'll be working on a gen with Ewok. And then him or Sam, and one of them will blow a skill check, and they'll blame everyone else. It's it's great. <laughs> uh, That's fun. Uh, what is your biggest pet peeve related to streaming? Um, I mean, I don't know if it's a pet peeve, but you know, I try to keep a positive atmosphere. Mm -hmm. And I know a lot of people out there like to take Dead by Daylight really seriously. Mm -hmm. And a lot of them like to come around and say some really mean things. And, you know, it's not it's not cool. Like at the end of the day, it's a game. Mm -hmm. You know, it, not every match is going to go the way you want it to. I mean, a lot of them don't go the way I'd like it to. But, you know, it happens. Mm -hmm. um, but there's really no no need to be mean about it. You know, so exactly. I think just people coming in here and saying some pretty, pretty mean things um it, that's probably one thing that you know like i said i like to keep things positive you know so that kind of like puts a wrench in, in things sometimes but uh you know we 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 deal with it the best we can mm -hmm. you know and um you know i try to remind people it's just a game yeah you know it's, you, and you need to have fun with it exactly exactly <laughs> yeah. it's it's one of those things of um people get so frustrated sometimes that like they don't win every single game. Like you're not supposed to mean you're not supposed to win every single game. You're, you know, like it's there's matchmaking for a reason. There's different things. Like it's a game. You're not the best in the world. You're going to lose a game, and it's okay to lose a game. Okay. It's okay to completely get destroyed by the other side. You know, it, it's fun when you destroy someone or you you know on either side but like it's still one of those things of like there's still learning experiences to come from both things you know it's it's great to stay positive um it's great you know like <laughs> i know we're supposed to win all the time that's why that's what I, I like to um but it, it's funny it, it's funny uh because like one of my biggest tips i give to some uh to people as a killer main is people they always want to get better at killer. They're like, oh, I need slowdown perks. I need this or I need that. But, like, at the end of the day, like, the, a lot of people are taking shortcuts uh, at the game. You know, uh, camping, yeah. tunneling, proxying, uh, going after the weakest survivors first. You know, like, if you actually want to improve your gameplay and improve your skills a lot of times, like, it, you need to face people that are better than you. You need to go against those people that are better than you because you learn that way. Like, exactly. With me going perkless on every single killer and having like whatever seven hundred and fifty games or something like that crazy that I have so far in there, like it's taught me a lot about what you can do with each killer with no perks or add-ons, you know, like it gets you better at being able to read what a survivor's going to do, what they're you know, how they loop, you know, you, you start seeing these little things that you're able to pick up on, like little cues that people do, you know, like if you're in a chase with someone for a little bit, you can start picking up on what they're going to do and they become very predictable on a lot of those things. So it's like right. one of those things of like, it's good to lose because you start learning more. Like yeah. it, it's, it's easy. Anyone could really sit there and camp, you know, there's ways to get around that as survivors, you know, but still it's one of those things of like, it's okay to lose. It's okay to have fun. Even memeing around and doing nothing, you know, I enjoy it. Yeah. I enjoy memeing around. Um, <laughs> I have some fun little clips I'll share in a little bit of uh, me meeting around with a Vecna. 
Um, <laughs> oh no. Okay. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if you guys know this. There is a, a new perk in the game. Um, was it uh, Bardic Inspiration? Like, who just carries like a little loot or something around with them to play like music just to get people going? Um, I love it. It's so uh, cute. <laughs> Up oh, there it is. <laughs> oh my god, yes. <laughs> uh, to just you know, just to mean with killers. It's fun. Uh I've got right? I've got so many things with that perk. It is great. I love it. It's uh, actually a pretty good perk. Um <laughs> uh, it's just one of those it's fun things of like I can't believe uh that they're adding so many fun different things in, in the game to you know, just to move around and have fun. That's like one of my favorite things to do right now is play the guitar. Um, and there's some killers that love it. There's some killers that absolutely hate it. But, you know, it's still fun. <laughs> it's fun. I love it so much. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's great, you know. Uh, I'm glad. I'm glad that you enjoy the positivity and you, that's what you look for when you're yes. streaming. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think this kind of goes hand in hand with what you were talking about last time, but we'll still touch base on it. What are your yeah. goals in streaming? Yeah, so positivity. Um, mm-hmm. So the biggest thing is when I finally got into Dead by Daylight and I started to kind of obsess about it, I'm like, I really like this game. It's so much fun. Um, you know, a lot of matches are just not the same, and I love it. Um, I wanted to become a De- Dead by Daylight streamer. And like we were talking about, you know, there's a lot of like hatred and negativity that can come with this game. And like, I don't really understand it. I'm just like, there's so much more good out there than there is bad. And I'm trying to be one of those like positive Dead by Daylight mm-hmm. streamers to show that you don't have to be super negative or super competitive or, you know, anything like that to win the game, you know, mm-hmm. like Dead by Daylight, first and foremost, should be a fun game, mm-hmm. you know? And, you know, that's something that I want to showcase is like, it's okay to lose or win or whatever, just as long as you're having fun. Yeah, And that's what I want to showcase that, you know, not not every Dead by Daylight survivor or killer out there is like being mean to everybody. You know, there are some people who are actually genuinely playing and having fun. So I try to showcase that. And yeah. on top of that, I, I like to make people laugh. So I'm very silly on my streams. I like to be silly and goofy and, you know, um, just try to make somebody smile at the end of the day. No, I agree. I love that. I <laughs> yeah. love making people laugh. Um <laughs> There, there's there's so much power and laughter and how yeah. like having a good time you know like we don't need to take everything seriously it's at okay. the end of the ga- day it's just a game and just have some fun you know we don't need to be yeah. stressed out about it you know <laughs> we're not yeah. going to the world tournament exactly <laughs> everybody thinks it's a competition it's not exactly <laughs> it should be fun it should be fun um mm-hmm. who is your favorite survivor and why is it nick cage <laughs> I was waiting for this one. <laughs> so, um, okay. So I absolutely love Nick Cage. I mean, I love him as an actor. I completely flipped out and it was so excited when I saw the trailer that he was coming out. So, um, when, you know, when he came out, I'm like, he's going to be my very first prestige character. And he mm-hmm. is. And, um, you know, before that though, <laughs> I actually loved, um, I actually play Claudette a lot. Um, so she was my very first, um, favorite survivor oh, nice. and of course now it's now it's nick cage because it's, it's, it's nick, nick cage, cage. It's nick cage. <laughs> um i also love jane because she's a big bigger girl you mm. know like me and i absolutely love the fact that they're adding more shapes and sizes to uh survivors and yeah. i guess killers even mm-hmm. um you know to show that you know not everybody is the same look you know exactly. everybody's different and Everyone's i different. love that they're they're adding diversity in in different ways yeah. so i love it <laughs> i know i know they're working on it i know there's a big controversy right now with um just some some survivors not getting some love while others kind of are becoming cash cows for for everything but i i do love that there is diversity in the game um yes. that they're hitting on a lot of different things you know uh, body positivity on you know just different builds and everything you look at jeff i i love some of jeff skins yes um <laughs> it, it's funny i know a lot of people were calling out the new jeff skin uh for him being like a barbarian mm-hmm. um and how he kind of lost his uh his bare gut 
Uh, and he's been working out. Spin. Yeah, he's been working out. You know, <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> it's okay. We still love Jeff. We we still do love Jeff. I know a lot of people are like sad about it, but it's one of those things of like it kind of fits the character. He's supposed to be barbarian a little bit, you know. Like, yeah. it's okay, but like I still love the representation um, of the dad bod and everything. You know, it, it's great. <laughs> Yes. Um, it's just, it's great that they have so many different things out there and they're trying to, you know, show the love, you know, they could do a little bit better on some cosmetics, you know, like Gabe doesn't have shit and Hattie, you know, I love Hattie. She's great. And she has yeah. some crap cosmetics and no wonder probably why they don't sell. I honestly think they'll, they'll come out with better stuff. They, they keep coming out with a lot of cosmetics. So I'm, I'm, you know, pretty confident they're going to come out with some really great stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So. I agree. So I'm I'm hoping I'm hoping. Fingers crossed mm-hmm. for that. It's great yes. stuff. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, what got you into playing video games? Oh my gosh, I've actually been playing video games since I was a little kid. I actually used to beat my dad, who was into video games. Um, he he thought he was great at video games until I started being him at like really really young age. <laughs> it was so great. Um, I've mostly been playing console. Uh, games. Mm-hmm. Uh, I didn't start playing PC until I started playing DVD, so that would be in 2017. Um, but I mostly played like all console games, mostly PlayStation. So oh, nice. I just have always loved video games. It's just always been a positive um, influence on me and a positive distraction when I've had a bad day or anything like that. It's just something fun to do, and I still continue to love playing video games. So <laughs> I agree. I agree. Um... I have been playing video games since I can remember. I was probably yes. two years old, you know, uh, playing Mario with my family, you know. I grew up on Nintendo and PlayStation. Um, and so I, I get it, you know. Like, for me as a kid, it was like an escape. Um, yeah. I had a rough childhood. Um, and it was just like a nice little adventure to get out and deal with stuff, you know. Like, I learned how to read from video games, you know. Like, mm-hmm. I played a lot of RPGs. <laughs> So wow. it helps my helps my vocabulary a little bit, yeah. um, but I always loved it. I always connected with a lot of people. It's it's one of those great things that uh, I love. So I'm glad it's it can bring out so much like love and how it's more quote unquote mainstream nowadays, which is nice because yeah. it's it's nice that it brings people together. You know, mm-hmm. uh, it's great. I love playing games with my wife. You know, we'll play you know like moving yeah. out and all those fun different things or. Here and there, we'll play, you know, Mario and stuff. So it's always fun, um, mm-hmm. fun thing to do with the kids too. So I, I love it. Yeah. Uh, it's a great bonding experience for a lot of people. It is, yeah, for sure. Hey, don't make me get my ace hat out. I have my ace hat. <laughs> I got. If you guys didn't know, I end up getting the the Dead by Daylight's eighth anniversary mystery box. Oh, nice. Yeah, and so I got a couple <laughs> fun things in here. I'll show it off here in a minute. Awesome. I have my ace hat. I have a record. I got uh, some other fun stuff. So it's great. (laughs) Great. What is one food that you'd bring to like a potluck or a party or something? Um, For a party, I'd bring chips and dip, like queso dip or something. I just, I'm kind of like old school. I, or not old school, but I'm kind of simple. Um, (laughs) I guess for a potluck, I'd bring like potato salad. I'm kind of weird. I don't, I'm, yeah, I don't cook, so <laughs> not. I mean, I cook, but I don't cook well, so you know. <laughs> I, I get it. I, get I bring it. something simple. <laughs> I'm a big foodie. I, I love food. Um, me too. <laughs> me and DJ always uh, we always have fun. We've uh, we like to cook for each other a lot. When we used to do it, when we worked out really hard, me, him, and the wife, and uh, wow. we'd trade off on cooking dinners. Oh, that's awesome! And uh, we've had a lot of fun stuff. We've cooked each other yeah. a lot of fun foods and. Always like that. I always like bring like random things. I've always been potato salad guy. I brought uh, you know deviled eggs. I'm always a big deviled eggs guy. <gasps> what is your What is eggs. your favorite? I know. I'll just come up with random <laughs> ask questions. What is your favorite thing to eat at like a potluck or a party? What are you hoping that they bring? Mine's deviled eggs, probably. Yeah, I I would agree. I love deviled eggs. They're so good. I could oh. eat like a whole bunch of those. Oh, I can too. That's one of my favorite <laughs> so things bad. for like Thanksgiving and stuff. Like, oh yeah, <laughs> some good pumpkin pie, some deviled eggs, some stuffing. Oh, uh, I love stuffing too. Pumpkin pie. Oh, I love I love everything in Thanksgiving. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> uh, deviled eggs. Oh, that's those are yes. so freaking. My mom used to like. I grew up really poor. We used to have like. Uh, the leg sandwiches a lot, so uh, I used to just mount on those for a long time. I love those. Yeah. 
My mom used to make bologna and cheese sandwiches. Those are oh, yeah. It was funny. Like, <laughs> I my mean, mom, it's simple. <laughs> my mom was over. She came and visited uh, me and the family uh, from yeah. the state over, and we are going to make sandwiches last night for dinner. And we were like, what do you want for sandwiches? Why is it if we make sandwiches? She's like, bologna sandwich. My brother was like, ew, I don't want that. Uh, <laughs> That's what like, I used to eat. <laughs> I still I, do, I, actually. I, I still eat them every once in a while. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, it's better than what she used to. She always she always get uh, liver's worst. Um, and for some reason, I ate it as a kid. I, I'll probably eat it still to this day. I don't like liver and onions or anything, but liver's worst, I don't know well, what it is about it, but I'll eat that shit. Or Double I used food's to. pretty good, too. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, they're great stuff. Um, mm-hmm. Why do you still play DVD after so much time in this game? What keeps you coming back? Um, I just absolutely love it. And I, I'm always excited for the next chapter, the next new thing. Um, their events are so much fun as well. So I'm always looking forward to the next, uh, next event. By the way, we need another blood moon event. Just saying. We do. And (laughs) absolutely amazing. And, um, you know, I just, uh, they're always having something like, um, fun, you know, and, uh, like I said, the new chapters and everything like that, they're adding more fun and more things to the game. And it just keeps it, for me, it just keeps it like super entertaining and I love it. <laughs> Devil like sandwiches, you guys put pickles on there and that's delicious. Just a Ooh, heads up on there. Good. It's really good. <laughs> uh, I'm hoping, I'm hoping the eighth anniversary, there's going to be a lot of uh, great, great, uh, how should I say this? Uh, blood points, <laughs> many, many blood points. I want them all. Um, yes, blood Moon was too. like Blood Moon picked up there towards the end. It was you got a lot of blood points. It was so great. So, so many blood points. <laughs> so so many blood <laughs> so points. So great. Yes. <laughs> uh, what is your favorite streamer moment that you've had as a streamer? Um, I hope I'm answering this right. Um, I think currently this year I had my birthday stream. And I cosplayed as Tiffany. Mm -hmm. It was so much fun. I had so many people there. I had so many people just supporting me and absolutely loving it. And it made me feel like I'm a streamer, you know? (laughs) I I, I know it's kind of silly, but it made me feel more of a streamer than than anything. And it was just so much fun. And everybody, like, helping and contributing. And it was just so much fun. And... Um, I definitely would do that again in heartbeat. <laughs> of course, of course, it's it's uh, great yeah. stuff. So it, it's, it's probably my favorite. It's <laughs> um, that's great. You know, like those those moments are what makes streaming great and makes you want to yeah. come back for more of just just the love and positivity people can bring and just mm-hmm. how much they love and support you. Yeah. And it, it just makes you feel so great. It's just. It's great to be in a community and have those people that love you and support you and, mm-hmm. you know, go out there and, you know, just have fun, hang out with you, you know? It was great, great. I uh, love my community. <laughs> you, have a, you have a wonderful community. Um, yeah, I, you do. I get, you oh, do, I thank too. You. I appreciate it. They're pretty good. Yeah. They're pretty good. They're pretty good people. Mm-hmm. Of course, you're part of it. So it's it's one of those great yeah. things that um, it's just great. It's great to have, like, a little family, you know, people to have those common interests with and just... Let's support you no matter what, you know, uh, yes. understand, you know, things that you've gone through and things that you've done. Um, it's just great. Um, yeah. And for those that don't know, I was going to put a fun little montage. I never got to it. Uh, but Jim, she loves to crochet and everything. And she made some awesome little Tiffany and Chucky's. Uh, for her birthday stream, and they've turned out freaking amazing. Uh, Thank I'll tell you. you what, I tell you what, they were a lot of work. <laughs> oh, I bet, I bet, they turned out awesome. Thank you. <laughs> You're very welcome. Um, what are what is some advice you might have for some newer streamers or content creators or anyone that's struggling um, that needs some advice on you know. Um, just a pick me up or just something that will help them out. Like what is some go-to advice you like to give people that are in the content creation space? So I'm not an expert, but Mm -hmm. (laughs) I do have actually eight years of experience so far. Um, honestly, I know what's really intimidating when you first start streaming is trying to get people to come and watch. You have to keep streaming Mm -hmm. to gain a community. 
Exactly. Um, you know, that's the thing. You, you got to keep going. You got to keep doing what you're doing. Believe in what you're doing and just keep at it. You know, um, do the best that you can. People will come to you and people will come and support you. You got to build that family, that community. And that's where people will start coming to watch you. I know a lot of people get intimidated. They're like, oh, I only have one viewer. You know, you just got to keep at it. You know, I, I had zero viewers at one point. And, you know, I kept at it and, you know, uh, people keep coming by now and they're they're so freaking amazing and I love them so much. And, you know, you just got to keep at it, keep doing what you're doing. And the other thing, too, is play a game or do something because you can do more mm. than gaming on Twitch. Do something or play a game that you enjoy. Um, uh, people will kind of figure out if you're not enjoying a game. Mm -hmm. um, you want to play, even if you're a variety streamer, if you play different games, that's fine. But, you know, make sure that you're playing something that you enjoy. Exactly. And um, people will definitely like enjoy it with you and um, be there for you. And that, that's something that's very important. Yeah, uh, because people can tell. They can tell <laughs> if you're not invested in the game, not enjoying it. Why, why, why should they hang out there if you're not <laughs> enjoying it? Things like that. Like they're looking for people to enjoy things and have fun. Unless exactly. you're dying at Dark Souls and things like that, they enjoy watching that. <laughs> they like, they, like they enjoy that. Suffer. <laughs> that's what they're they're for, you know. Right. <laughs> um, that's awesome. That's some great advice, DJ. Thank we you. might be taking some questions from the audience as long as you guys are kind i know jim's a little a little nervous here and there but we love and adore her so we'll make sure the <laughs> questions aren't hard uh no calculus questions dj i know how big of a math nerd you are i'm uh, not good my own <laughs> <laughs> i play games that's about it <laughs> she will not help you with your coding homework dj you have to ask someone else <laughs> um <laughs> Who uh, was the first survivor and or killer you fell in love with in this game? I, I think oh, you so kind of answered that earlier with Claude. I did. I'm sorry. So Claude. Oh, that is okay. I, I, yeah. I, um, I actually played her for a full year until I decided to play somebody else. <laughs> I, uh, I just absolutely loved her. And I used to have a, a friend who would play Jake and we were like boyfriend and girlfriend. It was great. <laughs> and um, the very first killer that I actually like fell in love with and thought, oh my gosh, this killer is so cool was Huntress. Oh, um, she's when she came out, I saw the trailer for her. I heard the humming. I saw like, she's this strong woman, mm -hmm. you know, and the whole thing with throwing the hatchets and everything. I thought, wow, this is cool. This is a really neat mechanic um, that they added. And so I was super excited and I still love Huntress. Oh, Huntress um, you great. know, I, I do play Huntress. I'm not as good with her, but she was definitely my, my oh, first love. Doesn't matter killer, if you're great so. with them. If you love them, you love them. <laughs> You don't yeah. care about if you're great. You love something. Yeah. You love something. I know right. Tiffany's your your main lady right now. Your main squeeze. Right so right now, yes. <laughs> absolutely love her. Um, talking about that, how how do you feel after the change on this uh, on this uh, update? I haven't played her yet. It Okay, so it's a little rough because there's no more scamper. Um, you actually have to do a slice and dice in order to go underneath the pallet. It's very sad, but I will get used to it. Um, <laughs> I understand why they got rid of it. They mm -hmm. didn't want people to do an easy basic attack afterwards, and I get that. Um, but I've noticed that you have to actually like do the slice and dice in order to go under the pallet now. So you mm -hmm. have to like charge it up and then you go under. Yeah. Um, so it's it's different. Um, so it's something that I'll have to get used to. Um, I don't hate it, but I'm just it's, it's, it's different. Something I have to get used to. Yeah. yeah it's a change. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> I completely get that. Um, what is your one crutch perk that you have on survivor side or killer side or both? <laughs> I think everybody knows this one. Um, <laughs> everybody that knows me anyway. Um, so in the beginning, it used to be borrow time, but then they made that basket. Mm. Um, that was now mine too. Yeah. <laughs> now it's kindred. So the reason why I constantly have to have that perk like always is because I have gone to second stage on hook because no one went for the save because no one knew anybody was going for the save. Yeah. So I have that as information. Hey, no one's going for the save. I'm going to go for the save. Um, and then for killer is Lightborn. 
<laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I know, but it's because um, there are so many flashlights, and and not not just flashlights. We have flashbangs now, mm -hmm. and blast mine, and firecrackers, and yada yada. So it's not just flashlights anymore. So there's a lot of things that that can happen. So um, I do use that. I it's terrible. I know I should get use of flashlight saves, but <laughs> that's definitely one that I'm running killer for sure. It's my that's what's great. Micro that's trick. Sam's. That's Sam's. <laughs> that's Sam's perk too. He, he loves. He loves using. <laughs> he loves using Lightborn. He yeah. has bad eyes, so it, it, like when he gets oh. blind, it really messes with his eyes. Um, you know, just he he does also have sometimes he he'll play with people and they'll blind yeah. him with flashbangs and they don't mm. warn about it. You know, they're horrible people that do that. Yeah, it's um, me. I'm the problem. The Exactly. But do you remember when Lightborn or uh, flashlights used to be like a bright white light? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you're around then. <laughs> it was awful. <laughs> it literally would be like retina like killing. Um, and then they changed it to that like purple kind of tone now, which mm -hmm. is so much better. It is great. But, yeah. Yeah. It is great. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. It's just one of those things of, uh, I haven't, I don't think I was around then. I started playing, okay. I think I've been playing like three years. I can't remember. Oh, okay. Uh, so I don't think I was back there. I, I just came in, like, right as... I think maybe Trickster was the next killer that came out. So I like, think it was before then, yeah. They yeah. changed it to, like, the purple, like, brownish color. Um, it used to be a bright white light. Oh, man, that's horrible. <laughs> and it was horrible. And so they finally changed it to that. And and even with that, unfortunately, I still run like born. So. Oh, yeah, that, that's completely understandable. It's, <laughs> it's one of those things that... Uh, yeah it's not fun um it's funny yeah. like, i know a lot of people got they got mad when they took away the flashlight clicking like we can't do that and no. i was like i actually understand if they didn't give that as a reason like like it was a good reason that they gave you know for i you know flashing could not lights stand the the sound i really couldn't uh because it was constant and mm -hmm. um unfortunately some people would do a thing to make it click a lot faster yeah and it for me just hearing that was just awful so i'm actually really glad that they changed that to be honest i think it was multiple things that maybe one of them as well is just the sound of it yeah um, i know i know they talked about it for epilepsy for triggering that way and which yeah. i completely understand the strobing lights you know a lot of people don't understand it so they made it a lot more slower um, right but now they have strobing lights that are having issues uh, just in case yeah. anyone doesn't know there is a bug currently out with trickster right now that can cause uh uh strobing lights i believe it is on the survivor side that it strobes um so. so you guys have to be careful there yeah i heard about that yeah uh thank you ethereum thank you thank you welcome in ethereum says hi um hi. <laughs> but yeah it, it's just one of those things it just it's it's you know it's we have all those perks for me on uh uh for on killers mostly it when i play is uh nurse's calling that's my huge mm. huge huge thing that's a good one yeah Ooh, that's yeah. a good question dj wants to know <clears throat> actual question what was jim's favorite chapter reveal Ooh, what was your favorite reveal uh so like chapter um chapter wise yeah I want to say Chucky because um, I was super excited about having finally having like a killer where we could see third person view. Mm -hmm. I, I think um, that's actually probably one of the reasons why I love playing Tiffany is I kind of like that. Yeah. I mean, I, I understand the first person view for killer, mm -hmm. um, but I really love that we can kind of see um, the killer at, as a third person, yeah. which is great. Which so I know there's a I lot of people that... that don't play killer because they don't like the first person. Like, like right. Alicia, my wife, she hates watching me play killer because excuse me she gets motion sickness from it so yeah. so yeah. she doesn't like watching me play that and she's like i can watch you play survivor she's like i just hate watching you play killer because you move around so fast you move around she's like it just makes me motion right. sick yeah so it, it's I, great yeah. that that gave people a character to play if they hated that first person view so i i love that that's great mm -hmm. uh the reveal for chucky was big you know like there's so many people that counted him not coming to the game and it was great that he actually came to the game there were two things they said they would never bring to the game clown and a small person mm -hmm. <laughs> and guess what mm -hmm. <laughs> this was like eons ago when they said that <laughs> uh now they're gonna bring they leprechaun <laughs> Like probably oh, I love but that. they also started with victor though yeah so i think victor was in a way kind of a test mm -hmm. to see hey maybe we can try to do somebody who's smaller yeah so 
I think that was a kind of a thing. <laughs> oh, well, Victor, good old guy. Yeah. He needs, he needs to get, get a new home. Yes. <laughs> um, let's see. What is your favorite map and why? Azeroth's. Um, I think it's called Azeroth. Um, I just like the way it looks. Mm -hmm. um, all the different forms of, of that map. Um, I, I guess I like the green tones and things like that in it. Um, and also, it's an outdoor map. I am yeah. not a fan of indoor maps. Uh -huh. <laughs> I always feel like uh, there's too many dead ends in indoor maps. Uh, you're outside, you have more room. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you're free. Um, <laughs> so uh, that's probably my favorite. I mean, I, I like a lot of maps, but like I said, I, I unfortunately, indoor maps, I'm not really a big fan of. But um, that's probably my favorite series of maps for sure. Nice, nice. Yeah. Um, <laughs> question from Sam. What is your absolute favorite build, survivor or killer? Uh, currently, um, Kindred. <laughs> <laughs> um, and because of Ultimate Weapon and all that, I, I have been starting to run Calm Spirit and Distortion. So I they can find me. <laughs> um, <laughs> and I've been running the, the newest... Um, well, I would be running resilience too because uh, a lot of times I would be injured mm -hmm. during matches, so that would help for sure. So yeah. that's kind of my build for survivor, for killer. Currently, I absolutely love um, unforeseen. Mm -hmm. um, Unforeseen's fun. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, nowhere to hide. Mm -hmm. um, unless I'm running distortion, but <laughs> um, let's see what else. Uh, Lightborn and. Um, um, barbecue can be pretty good. I'm sad they took away the points, but yeah. I understand why. <laughs> it's true. But I like barbecue. Yeah. <laughs> Got another question from the audience. Yeah. Are there any killers or survivors that you would like to see come into DBD? More in a cage. No, I'm kidding. Um... <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? Um, no, I'm, I'm going inter <laughs> to interrupt you for a minute. I was really hoping yeah. when they brought Nick Cage in that he could be a killer and a survivor just like him just have like different things as a survivor and then just like one of his villains or something because at that time he had that one vampire movie that came out yes or yes. something like that i would have been hilarious to have him as a killer too uh, yeah it was hilarious I, that's what yeah. i was really hoping for <laughs> go on <laughs> no 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 you're fine um i actually don't know i know there's been um i know a lot of people want to bring in jason um, but, you know, the whole thing going on. I, I don't know. I keep hearing that it, it might actually be a thing. Um, Jason would be a cool addition. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. I don't know. They're starting that whole <laughs> new Jason verse. So Yeah. Like, so we might have a chance. Mm -hmm. um, so that the would actually be cool. Because, yeah. Because a lot of people have been wanting Jason in DVD. Mm -hmm. But because of everything going on, um, you know, it hasn't really been a thing. Um, so, I mean, honestly, though, to... <sighs> I really, the biggest reason why I enjoy Dead by Daylight, I love the licensed killers and survivors, don't get me wrong, but one of the biggest reasons why I love Dead by Daylight is the originality. Um, you know, the original characters. Yeah. Um, I really enjoy those. Um, I mean, even even Plague, which is kind of gross, but like it's, it's original, mm -hmm. you know, and things like that. And the whole thing with uh, Charlotte and Victor, the twins, um, you know, all these different kinds of killers, the original kinds. Yeah. Um, those are very interesting because it's not something that we we already know. Like Freddy, yeah. okay, we know you're gonna go to sleep, whatever. Like we already know that. And but with these original killers and survivors, it's like it's something new, and it's kind of and it's very exciting when we get something completely out of out of the norm. So, yeah, I completely agree. It. Sam yeah. Sam says it all the time. He always gets mad when. When he hears there's uh, more uh, licensed killers coming out. And I know. I, I kind of get, it's not that I get upset, but I'm just like, can we get something original this time? You know? <laughs> it's it's yeah. fun to get both. Like, yeah, when they have like because... a fun, like, I love the unknown. Like, the unknown is such a fun, like, cool concept. It's creepy. <laughs> I love it too. Yeah, the the concept and it's super creepy and it's all twisted and everything. That That's more horror, you mm -hmm. know? And I, I really absolutely love it. I it's love great. the reveal for them as well of just yes. like the, the teaser trailer. Like that was great. Like it uh, was so Blair Witch. I loved it. <laughs> it was so great. I mean, not really, but it's but it, yeah, it was very. I know similar. what you meant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Uh, got another question here. If you had to create a killer for DVD, what would their ability be, and what would they look like? That's a tough question. 
That's a very tough question. I have no, I, I know that I've talked to people about it before. I, and I know it's not original, but we, I would love to have some kind of werewolf or some mm. kind of vampire um, kind of uh, killer where like, I mean, I guess we kind of had it with Legion, but mm. a, um, I talked to some friends before. It would be kind of cool if like the killer could actually transform into a survivor. Mm -hmm. And it would totally throw people off. Oh, yeah. You know? Like, oh, God. But I guess Legion's kind of like that. But not yeah, really. I not don't know. Really, but it yeah. would be kind of it would be kind of cool, like, mm -hmm. to throw survivors off. Like, oh, God, is this really a survivor or is it a killer? You yeah. know? Um, things like that. Or, like I said, a werewolf would be kind of cool or something like that. Um, you know, maybe you can turn into the werewolf or something. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It'd be kind of cool. But that, I don't really have, like, amazing ideas. Those are just, like, little ideas I've... I've tossed around with other people. <laughs> you know, it'd be a fun game mode. <laughs> this is a mimic killer, yeah. There like, you go. A mimic killer would be cool. No, 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 that's true. Uh, yeah. An idea that I I love I love that is maybe have like a game mode where you one person's a vampire and they don't know, like you know, and you're yeah. doing things like that would be fun. That would be cool. Oh my gosh, I would totally play that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, DJ. Uh, what if oh, we no. added building, like, in Fortnite? Jeez, JK, okay, please don't do your own back. I was going to say, I, I've actually started playing Fortnite, um, and I only played the zero build. I've never actually played the build one, so I don't know if I'd play that. <laughs> I like zero build. It's so much more fun. <laughs> you know, they would have to add cars, because that's all Fortnite is right now, right? Is cars. <laughs> That's kind of what's going on in the season too. All the cars. It's, it's crazy how they they change their meta so much. Like yeah. I've just been playing for like three seasons or something. Yeah, I DVD just started. Bounce. Oh, that'd be hilarious. Yeah. Uh, I think I have one last question for you. Um, okay. Then we'll wrap the questions up unless we get another question or two from the the group. <laughs> uh, what is your favorite DVD fit? Like outfit, outfit, I wasn't yeah. Sure what... mm -hmm. Okay, outfit. Um, <laughs> back to Huntress. I absolutely love the Were Elk and the Baba Yaga outfits. Ah. They're so good. Oh my god. Um, especially the Baba Yaga. It looks amazing, and I love the the witch like mm -hmm. sound that comes from her. Um, ah, that's I don't a, know. Such I, a great one. Yeah, there's so many great outfits. I mean, anything on Nick. My my shiny Nick one, the Valentine's outfit. Um, <laughs> I absolutely love that one. Uh. Michaela has like a bunch of really cool ones. Um, mm -hmm. It's hard. To, it's hard to choose. There's so many great outfits, but yeah, those are a few of my favorites, probably. Um, oh, and of course, I love Krampus. Uh, Krampus Trapper. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that, that's a good one. I, I think that's one that. I, one outfit I don't have. Yeah. Oh, it's Krampus. so good. I might, I, I might have I, got it for Christmas though. Really? <laughs> I, I wear it all year round. Well, Naughty Bear came out, but I absolutely love tra uh, uh, Krampus Trapper and um, the Minotaur. Um, Oni. I love that so Minotaur Oni too. Yeah, That's a great yeah. one. I use that one a and of lot. Course, and of course, all the kitty outfits. All the kitty outfits. <laughs> Can't forget the kitty outfits. All the kitty outfits for e either killers or survivor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, I love them. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, we got two more questions. If you could take back any change or update they made to DVD, what would it be? For example, maybe a perk that got nerfed, etc. Barbecue and chili. I would love the bullet points again. Um... But I, I get why they did it. It's just mm. I would love it again. Yeah, I agree. Um, I don't know. I um, yeah, probably just that one. I I don't know. I mean, I love the fact that like bar time is base kit, so you don't have to like run that anymore. Mm -hmm. Um, so that one's good. But uh, yeah, I don't know. That's probably the only one I could think of. Sorry. That's <laughs> well, okay. Then yeah. Sam had a question. What would you rank this sure. casual build on a scale of one to ten? They got Counterforce, Inner Strength, Overzealous, and Small Game. All the totems, um, <laughs> except for Overzealous. Um, well, Overzealous is totem, too, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. No, wait. I thought that's the one where you get hit and... Uh... So, Overzealous, you get, uh, I think, a 5% increase on gen speeds after you're cleansing a totem. And if you take out a... Oh, uh, right, right. I'm thinking, a, I'm thinking yeah. of Overcome. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I was close. Okay. Yes. Um... Absolutely love that build. Uh, one to ten, mm, seven. Because like I, you know, it's funny when I first started uh, playing Dead by Daylight, I hated people doing totems. I'm like, why are you doing totems? Do gens. <laughs> and now I kind of like totems, so it's kind of fun, um, especially if they're shiny. 
uh, shiny, fiery ones. Uh, exactly. Um, that gives I you extra like on overzealous. Oh, yeah. yeah it gives yeah. you extra. It's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, here we got a question. If you could remove any killer from the game permanently, who would it be? Not fact. No, no I, I don't. Um, I, I'm un probably unpopular opinion. Leatherface. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, the only reason Lost why with Almighty. I probably did. Jay. I'm sorry. They're so both... the only the only reason why I say that is because the whole insta down. I can mow everybody down. Um, I really think that's unfair. You know, um, even hillbilly can only hit one person at a time. Yeah. So I honestly think that you know the whole oh I there's four survivors here. Let's just mow them all down. You know I I just yeah for me I've always had an issue with that. Um, so, I mean, I, I like the concept of the other face, but I just feel that there needs to be some kind of change to the power to the chainsaw. Other than that, I, you know, I don't, I don't mind him at all, but yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry. True. I probably just lost every single viewer in here. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that I don't like Leatherface as a character. I, I think he's great because, you know, he is iconic. Mm -hmm. Um, but you know, just, it's the power itself of like, insta downing everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Especially with yeah. some of his stuff he could do now. Like, he's he's a little bit of a monster right now. Well, yeah. they made it longer and yeah. everything, so it makes it harder to even, like, avoid, and that's the other issue. It's really hard to avoid now. So. And then you got the add-on that gives you, uh, you reset your chainsaw <clears throat> tokens when you down someone. I know. I'm yeah. sorry, Bill. I'm sorry. Um, um, <laughs> almighty. Almighty. Um, almighty, yeah. Sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. Uh, if you don't know, they buffed the shit out of Bubba, so you might come back for that. Be that toxic. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> um, DJ had a question. Mm -hmm. uh, Ewok and Dabo get into a cage fight. No weapons, no shirts. Who's tapping out first? I'll answer this one. Uh, that would be Ewok. <laughs> he is trained in the martial I arts. Uh, I am not. Oh. Uh, just because I trained the neighbor kids in karate when I was a kid and got them in trouble and they couldn't hang out with us anymore does not mean I know actual karate. Or that my brother also booby trapped the or we lived out in the in the woods. Uh mm -hmm. and he booby trapped the woods like we were in three ninjas. So I don't know some of you wow. younger people might not understand what three ninjas were, but they're pretty cool when we were younger, some of us, some of us older mm -hmm. people. Uh, former karate trainer. That is correct. I was. Wow. I had. Uh, uh, my mom had this little fort, and she painted uh, Ninja Turtles on the wall. It was pretty cool. Yeah. Tum tum. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's true. Okay. Right. Let's get to our first fun little segment here. It's going to be a fun thing. How well? How well do you know DBD, Jim? Pretty well. Pretty well. <laughs> I've been playing for seven. Well, yeah, seven years now. So. So, I think I have... Let me see here. Let me see here. Uh, I'm so nervous about this. <laughs> one, two, three... Seven sounds here. Okay. I, how many are you going to get Am I going right? to be able to hear it in here? You're going to be able to hear it in here, yeah. How many, how many, okay. how many sounds are you getting right? Okay. How, how many do you think you're going to get right? Uh, Out of seven. Some of them, they're, they're not too bad. I, I want to say all of them, but you know, I, I that's really. I think confident. you're. I think you're, you're. You're probably gonna get all of them. We didn't go okay. super super hard, but we'll see. All right. Let's let's go. If you get five right, I'll go gift five gifted subs to your channel. Oh God. Okay. The pressure is on. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Uh. Let's go with uh, this first one. Oh my gosh. I know that one. Would you like to hear it again? Yeah, I I know what it is. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> the pressure's on. on. Yeah. Oh, first before we do that, you can think about it. I'm sorry. Yeah. Let's yeah. do this here. Oh. Hold on. Uh let's do this. For some reason my thing's not working, but why don't you do this real fast? Yeah, you plug. Um, 
<clears throat> Let's just say you run a perk for this. Well, to prevent it. Oh, uh, being blinded. Mm hmm. That is correct. Okay. Let's go. I was like, I know that sound and I can't think of it right now. <laughs> okay. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. That is clown. <laughs> That is correct. Yeah. I'm like, I already know. Because I, I, it almost sounds like a... I want to say carnival music, but not really. Yeah. That's how I know it's clone. <laughs> oh, I hate him. <laughs> oh, my God. That's Blight. <laughs> that's Kitty Blight. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> yes. That's the yowl that I love so much. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. Let's see here. Go play Kitty Blight for that. <laughs> Oh god, uh, uh, I know that. Oh my gosh, oh, um. I want to say that's an aura thing. Um. Yeah, it's it, it's an aura, or, uh, uh, stacks, uh, uh. Yeah, distortion sound, right? Distortion, correct. Yeah, 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 because, like, I, I recognize that, because I run distortion. Okay. Sorry, I was like, I didn't think about that. Sorry, I was like, I was like, you said that, and I was like, oh, she's smoking. She better get this distortion right. I'm trying. <laughs> it's hard. It's hard when you're not thinking. It about is it. because you're used to it, and then you don't think about what it is exactly. You know, you just hear it all the time. <laughs> okay, this one might be a little easy. No pressure. That is Mikey, Michael Myers. Mikey breathing on your shoulder. <laughs> Every time I hear that, I freak out. I'm like, oh, God, it's Mikey. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ding. That is a totem sound from, like, small game. Correct. Yeah. Oops. Hold on. Oh, wrong, oh wrong did I miss it? No, you got it. <laughs> I got shot. No. That is the sound of the... The thing that's put on the palette um, when when you break it. Uh, I what it's called. Is it? Mm-hmm. Just what's its name? I forget what it's called. It's um. Heisenberg. Okay. He was into. Chemical. Chemical trap. Yeah. Chemical <laughs> trap. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't <laughs> think of it. I'm like, I actually you don't know what that it was. Work, so like, I forget. Sorry. <laughs> I, I'm like I know what the sound is. I just couldn't think of the perk, but I've I've gotten that as killer, and I'm, it it sounds like a bag of powder. Just yeah, it you does. <laughs> so you didn't get none of these. You're you're lucky. You got seven out of seven. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it took me a while. I I was actually very scared about this. I'm like I hear things, but I sometimes don't remember exactly what they are. So I was a little concerned. I'll be running distortion <laughs> or something or small game, and I'll be like, what the fuck is that noise? Like. <laughs> I know. Well, especially for small game, that dung. It's like, what the hell is that? And actually, when um, flashbang, you know, like uh, when you get enough for the flashbang, it mm -hmm. makes that noise. Yeah. It's like I, when I when I first came out, I was like, what is that? What is this? <laughs> and apparently, it's the sound that oh, you can make a flashbang. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> yeah. But there, yeah, we have our Almighty. nice little. <laughs> I, that's what it sounds like to me. I think it's supposed to be a chemical sound, but it sounds yeah. like powder, like poop. It's supposed to be like the ice <laughs> yeah. popping everywhere, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, something. You know, it's one of those blue blue dyes that come mm. out of like a you know a stolen bag of it's money. Stolen bag anyway. money. <laughs> so, when's the next time you're streaming? You're streaming Wednesday, right? I stream Wednesday through Friday, five thirty to nine thirty Pacific time. You'll see me there on Wednesday. Yeah. Get you five gifted <laughs> subs. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I appreciate it. Any time. HDMI cable want to go in the wall socket, guys. <laughs> Sounds like something I do. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, Behold, my shiny Nick. All right. So shiny. Mm -hmm. yeah, I have a, I have a lot of fun right now running this build here. It's my gin rushing build, but what's a lot of fun is nice. this build here. Still sight, diversion, distortion, and open-handed. 
Oh yeah, still sight. I've actually been running that to test it a little bit. Oh, it's a lot I like of fun. it so far. It's gonna help me when I'm like, where is a generator? <laughs> um, because <laughs> a lot of these maps, especially like the indoor maps, I'm like, I don't know where they are. Especially like Hawkins and stuff. Where are the where are the gens? I don't know where they are. I need to get a drink. But if anyone else would like to join us, just let us know. We'll get you in. We do have a spot open. <clears throat> have a good sleep artemis have a good sleep artemis <laughs> yeah my little paw patrol thing? yes <laughs> i love it <laughs> i'll go sell this for one of the kids yeah Ugh. just yep, like a yep, bard yep. it's true <laughs> For real. It is true. <laughs> yeah. No game sounds. Thank you, thank you, thank uh -oh. you. Uh-oh. Thank you, Sting. <laughs> there. We should have... Add some <clears throat> sound now. Okay. Tech promise to tell you. I haven't streamed in like a week. <laughs> I was gonna say I haven't seen you stream. I I miss you so much. Ah, yeah, I've been I know you've working. Been, on, you've been preparing. <laughs> working on this. Apparently not good enough, but you know it turned out fun. No. I liked. It. I'm it's, having so much fun. You guys are great. Having, That's what makes the community great. I'm you know. having the best time right now. Honestly, I I appreciate this so much. I'm having a lot of fun. So oh, all that good. Is good. <laughs> that is good. So what much. Fun. I, what do I got? Flashlight going on here. You're still up. Yes. That's what matters. <laughs> It is true. Yes. <laughs> I'm glad I got to do this on a day that you can uh, stay up a little bit and have some fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it. <laughs> of course, I appreciate you. Again, thank yeah. you so much for doing this. Of course. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's true. My community used to make me run upstairs, guys. This is nothing. See, I, I would be concerned if my community didn't like make fun of me and stuff like that. I'd be like, are, are you y'all okay? I mean, <laughs> are you good? Because <laughs> it's a, it's a sign of love. It is. <gasps> one, it is. One two one two three four. I declare a map war. <laughs> Let's go. It's a great first episode here. Yep. I'm having a lot of fun. I'll be adding more and more stuff to those things, like opening segments a little bit more, more prepared, but I'll be adding commercials in here too, just fun made commercials. Nice. Oh we'll my gosh, having, I'm excited. <laughs> we'll be uh, having uh, a commercial uh, brought to you by the creative mind behind uh, Killer Abs from Outer Space, P90X Defiant. It's... Uh, the workout videos, uh, body like DVD, you know. Oh gonna, my gosh, that's amazing! It's gonna be some great <laughs> workout uh, tutorials, guys. Yeah. Coming to a DVD <clears throat> near you, distortion. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. They have lethal. Who was it? Let's see who who is it. That slinger. That's a slinger. Oh no. He's found the shiny Nick. Has no appreciation for music. It wasn't country really. enough for him. That's so sad. It wasn't country music. enough for him. <laughs> <clears throat> no, no, buddy. Nope. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm screwed here. I'm screwed here. I blame Almighty. This is where he goes here. I am so rusty, guys. I don't see nothing. Killer Mane is rusty. <laughs> Double hit. Everybody patched up here.
Friends to land, okay. It's coming back. Yes. Oh god. I gotcha. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you. Right in the butt. All good. Follow oh, the shiny. Nope. No, right. nobody. No, thank you. Does not want the shiny neck. Sorry. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> no, no. Don't make me drop this pallet. <clears throat> I need to. Come over here. It's friends to Leon. No, nobody. No, thank you. You go that way. Kick that gen. Go that way. Yeah. Go that way. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. There's um. Put on Drip Fox already again? Shit. Really? WSGG? Oh gosh, I feel old now. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Jeez. Kids in their slang. De definitely not what would Jesus do. <laughs> oh my you're my you're my young and my slang person. Yeah, right. <clears throat> well, that's a What's good? Oh what's good? Thank you. See Almighty, you knew what's up. See you're right. So that's why I keep you around. It's going pretty well. It's going pretty well. Enjoying the night. Had a fun little interview with Jim here. Oh, I'm gonna go get no. the say. Oh, you got Kindred. I got, no, go. I'm got, yeah. I got it. That's why we're in Kindred. Yeah, I know. <laughs> all good, all good. <laughs> I got this. I'm very altruistic, unfortunately. <laughs> Gotta save all the peeps. Oh, oh. Over there, okay. Oh, minor headache. That's no what? No bueno. I hate those. I hate the hits. Hate those. You want to heal me real fast? Oof. Thank you. I appreciate you. Iron graphs too. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, play play me a song, girl. Yeah, yeah, good, good. Yeah, yeah, good, good. Yeah, yeah, good, good. She got me on that one, big boy. There we go. That's good. Ugh. I might go to second. I'm sorry. Good. You got him. You got him. You got him. You got him. Oh, my you God. That was so oh, close. I'm so, so sorry, close. Sam. So close. So oh. close. I wanted to finish the gun in there. I'm so sorry. We got it. We got that gym done. That's good. Oof. He's coming. Take your time. I don't mind hanging on a hook for a while. I don't know. I like hip was out earlier, so I know freaking pain and discomfort. I was like, ugh. Oof. You okay? Uh oh. We got we got uh, trip fox that needs. Yeah. Oh no, they're being chased though. Yeah. <clears throat> Come back through. Going behind. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Right through here. Oh yeah. Please, please pick up. Ah. 
as awaken awareness. Oh, it does. Okay. I tried, girl. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You know my Stanley Cup, huh? Mm. <laughs> you have one? Yeah, I have, I have like a handful of nice. them. Nice. The nice. wife got me a, a new one for Father's Day. It's uh, uh, it is Fourth Wing Cup. Ah, uh, nice. <clears throat> I sorry, Fox. I'm so sorry. I know, Jeffo. I'll avenge you. I'll avenge you. Woo! Hi, buddy. Go that way. Someone's that way. Yeah, yeah, that way. Yeah. Yeah, that way. Yeah. Keep going that way. We appreciate you, Drip. You missed, buddy. Hey. Get over. He's over here. Kick that gin. <laughs> I don't have my fun build. I don't have my Sabo build. This would have been a lot different if I would have Sabo in. Uh oh. I'm in danger. I'm in danger. Mm hmm. He wants uh, a shiny Thank you so much for the follow, Fox. I appreciate it. Hopefully, your night's going well. Bella, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Taking him away from the. Just gen. Trying to have a fun build. I couldn't save like I should have. I heard the gen. I was trying to run away from it. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> oh no, he's going to you. There he is. <laughs> My bad. Don't be bad. He's coming back. I'm gonna get this gen popped. You're welcome. Hopefully your headache settles down. Hopefully your night gets better, or day, wherever you are in this world. Sit back and hopefully see some other people, not me, escape. <clears throat> okay. Okay, on Sam. Ooh. He said, get over here! <laughs> thank you, thank you. You're very welcome. Uh-oh. Say. Oof. Nobody. No, thank you. No, thank you. Come on. Get your ass over here. Probably gonna go after me. No, never mind. Alright, try to get Sam. No, <coughs> nobody. Uh uh. Let's go. Come here, sweet Everybody's boy. Coming back. No. Come on, sweet boy. Come on, big boy. Let's do this. Ah, oh, shit. I fucked up. I'm in danger. Oh, boy. I know. Not having like a good fun build on, I threw the game. Somebody's gonna fall for a rock Oof. somehow. Beeline it right over to you guys. Yep. Oh, you can see, you have whatchamacallit. No, 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 you're good. You're good. This is why I love Kindred. Yeah. <laughs> Not just the hooks, it's also informative on where the killer's yeah. going. <laughs> Very informative. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's slugging me. True. Oh, he's coming. <laughs> well, we tried. Crawl to hatch. You can do it. I don't know where it's at.
Getting my recovery points. <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Nice. Get it. Yeah, you're get getting it. at me. Get it. <laughs> I got 300 points. <laughs> Ah, oh, well, that's not a bad first game. Not a bad first game, no. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah. Yeah, four gens done. I'm proud of us. <clears throat> we did it. We did it. <laughs> Almighty. <laughs> I love you. Uh... <laughs> Oh, Lightborn, huh, that makes sense. That makes sense now, huh. I was like, I should've had two blinds on him. They played well, I like that map. I like that map for Slinger and Huntress and a bunch of people, that's one of my favorite maps to go to. Especially for Huntress, I could hit some mean cross map shots with her there. What about Blight though? I've heard it's pretty hard for Blight because there's a lot of stuff that you can slide off of. It's true. Yeah. So guys, what what do we want? Do we want like my savior build? Do we want a Mimi build? Do we want a gen rushing build? Do we want a looping build? What do you guys want? Okay, I'm I'm going with fun build then. Let's go. Fun build. It's gonna be toxic ace now. Load out. <laughs> that outfit. <laughs> Wait, build is that? Looping build, so you can keep the killer distracted while we do gens. Got it. <laughs> looping build, okay, I'll do a looping build. <laughs> Back to gen, we'll do a, my fun, fun looping build here. <clears throat> fun build, I can do my fun build here. DJ, let's go Michaela then. I think I have an... We'll do my fun build. I can still loop with this build. Firecracker. We'll do that. Flashbang. Okay. If anyone else wants to join, you guys can just let me know. Oh, I will bring... What do I want to bring? I'll do my fun build. They said fun build first. All right. That's actually what they kept saying repeatedly. <laughs> yeah. Stop what they asked for here. It's turning me on! Oh, no. Stop! Uh, I know, that redeem. <clears throat> okay. Actually, let's go medkit. Syringe. That's <laughs> good, good, Leon. Yeah. Being boozled. Apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Leon, she's just not into you, buddy. <laughs> I think you're cute. <laughs> <laughs> she's not her type. <laughs> yeah. We'll be shiny Nick after this, maybe. Yeah. 
I'm really excited for the event because there's going to be more like mass and everything. It's going to mm -hmm. be so much fun. And I heard Nick's getting something too. And I'm like, mm. yes. <laughs> oh, Nick. Nick's getting a shiny outfit. I'm excited. <laughs> more shiny. My beans going to be after this match. <clears throat> I have to uh, locate them. I love the masks as well. I think the masquerade masks are amazing. They're super fun. You're just going to question me to death. <laughs> that is fine. We could do that. Yeah. I'm just joking. <laughs> I love you, DJ. All good. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy 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 audience here it's okay we adore you all i love them so much <laughs> i need y'all to give me a visit sometime you guys are making me laugh i absolutely love it i adore it <laughs> a shout out for jim dj oh well thank you <laughs> You guys I, I'm don't just joking, really, but... Oh, no, no, but, yeah. I want people, if they don't know who you are, <laughs> you're very fun to watch. Well, thank you. I try. I do my best. <laughs> <laughs> I still love the fact I'm in front. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> it's true. It is fine. Yeah. Is that a blight, McKinn? No, know. Nimmy Nimmy. Okay. Like, I haven't heard anything yet. I'm probably, like, across the map. He's running to Shack area. It's definitely one of my favorite maps, for sure. Uh, it's one of them. I brought I brought, brought us here for you. Oh, you did? Oh, my gosh, I missed it. Oh, thank you. Yeah, You're definitely welcome. one of my favorite maps. Thank you. Get out of here. I don't know. I, I, I don't know what it is, but I love this map. Well... All the variations, but yeah. The variations, yeah. <laughs> They're fun. Yeah. Ten rat sized dabbles or one dabble sized rat. <laughs> oh god, neither. <laughs> Cause you'll have like all of the little ones screwing around and then the big one wouldn't intimidate me. <laughs> I'd run I, away I from the DJ. <laughs> Number two. No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> if he doesn't have his fun build, then he has to screw in a light bulb. Yeah, I have to look for the light bulb. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I have my fun build on, so, you know, right? we're going to have some fun yeah. here. Yeah. No, oh, thank you, buddy. Keep your dirty hands off me. Ooh, he's Them a tentacles. Me. You shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> no kicky kicking my gin, my friend. Okay. Get out of here, zombie. Is it Karen or Kevin? <laughs> it's Kevin. Okay, got it. <laughs> One of my friends calls him that. I love it. <laughs> oh, no. You're all sicky. No, oh, thank you. I don't want none. Let's <laughs> 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 run towards shack area. That's why I usually have like sounds to scream at me for redeems <laughs> because I forget them. <laughs> Oh shit. My fun build in the game. 
What's that sound? Oh, it's leveling up. No, I think somebody used a syringe. syringe. Something happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Hello. Hello. Oh god, I didn't mean a sabo. Oh, you got, he has totem to heal. Okie doke. Karen's after me. Not right. Karen. Ugh. She's slowly coming to me. She wants a refund. Oh god. I'm joking. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bad joke. How long would you live if you got transported into the fog, Jim? How long would I live? Not very long. I'm a big girl. I don't run. <laughs> Running away from the killer would be hard. <laughs> also, I don't know how to fix gens. I'm I'm not a tech person. I'm not an electrician. Oh god. Where yeah, buddy? You do see me. All right. You see the shiny Nick. All right. I'm luring him away. You missed. Oi. Okay. He did not miss. Oh god. I am. Oh god. I'm sandbagging. Mission to save Sam. Hi. Oh god. I'm gaming in the living room. Ow. That hurts, sir. I'm not gaming in the basement no more. My parents' basement, like those one people said. He's trying to smack me with his whip. Oh, hello. Where are you guys at? Oh god. <laughs> Over here. <laughs> I was like, I'm going down. <laughs> I ran into a tree. All right. Oh! <laughs> that was a fun build. <gasps> Thank you so much. That is a fun build. Oh my goodness. Oh, thank you. No, thank you. Oof. I don't want that was great. Cookies. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. I don't think I've seen your like fun build. Oh my god. <laughs> or I've missed Get out of here. Oh, uh, sorry. There's no one likes you, Nimmy. Okay, they're very good. You don't play at the fun bus? <clears throat> With the fast zombie. Oh my goodness. Speedy. Okay. Uh, blindfold is more fun, I think. I feel like if I played upside down, I'd be frustrated. <laughs> blindfold is more fun because it's like, what am I doing? <laughs> it's true. Yeah. Favorite cereal, Ooh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Some toast crunch is very good. I love cinnamon, so cinnamon sugar is my favorite. <laughs> uh oh, are we in danger? No. Background player is still great, guys. I still love it. Not oh, as yeah. fast as oh, it means, but it's still great. Oh, he wants the shiny Nick again. He punched me in the shoulder blade. Never mind, he went back. Oh god, Sam, no! A gen by the pillow is almost gone. Damn. He knew! He knows! He, knew. he knows too much! Classic I'm luring him away! He wants the shiny. Sam and their healing. Okay, I don't even know what happened with the both of us there. Oh god. 360, no scope! You got it, you got it. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Need to go that way, didn't Ooh. we? 
berry Shoot. soda. That sounds good. A little punishment? Uh, I don't know. It needs to come back. You have a wheel of punishment? <laughs> yeah. Wait, how did I not know this? <laughs> that was a long time ago. I haven't done it in a while. Oh, I was going to say, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm like, I, I usually watch your streams, but I, I feel like I missed something here. Okay. Oh, the oops all berries like Captain Crunch is really good, actually. Mm, that's also um, really good, yeah. Yeah. I think Nick sells his cough better. What up, Karen? Okay. I'm like this one right here at the was almost done. There we go. Yeah, did it. Oh, did it? Oh no. <laughs> the wrong way. Damn it. Of course, she went that way. Definitely proxy door. camping. <laughs> yeah. Do not blame them. Okay. There's no more juice boxes left, is there? <laughs> I think I bled. That well, blinded me. Oh. <laughs> I got a little too close. <clears throat> oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> I'm also infected. It did. So. Coming. Damn zombie. If you can go get the other Samoa yeah. or Sam up real fast, yeah. I'll recover. There's one here too. God. It's like the fast zombies. Okay. <laughs> that fast zombos. Alright. I know, I'm bossy, bossy, bossy. Is it Sam? You gotta go, you gotta go. Yeah, go Sam, go. Oh, he's being chased. Oh no. Oh no. I got a septic I'm gonna take. Oh, I'm not okay. having syringe, shit. Okay. Got it. Oh god. Go! No! Oh god, coming back. We can do this. We can do this. I'm gonna have to go. Oh, I have a zombie literally chasing me out. I can't. <laughs> That's okay. Okay. I don't know how you didn't wiggle out. Do you have Iron Grasp? I, I know, right? Think so. I no, I'm surprised about that. Unless it was part of Rapid Brutality, I'm not sure. 
Yeah. Well, maybe, I don't know. We hit no pallets. Almighty says, don't tell me to play. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go find the Dean Doozle, guys. I'll be right back. We'll put up a little be right back screen. Or just keep going straight in and vault. Oh my god, no, that's a I, I'm in a locker. <laughs> Get out, go to the left, and then vault the window. I'm in a locker. <laughs> Sonic, but I got some Sonic. I just got myself some cranberry lemonade. It's very tart and refreshing. How you doing? It's kind of like my personality. And then we had a spirit that we ran pretty well. We all got out. And now we're Ranked on our third 13, one. By the way. Yeah, he was a low rank. Shh, though. don't be telling people our secrets. <laughs> hey, if he. I don't care. I'm gonna take it because I'm not a seven right now. So <laughs> thanks to that thirteen, it works for me. Okay, I am back, guys. I am back. <laughs> I got this right here for you guys. Did you get the beans? Yeah. <laughs> I got the beans. I also had a good pee. <laughs> He's pretty lucky. <laughs> okay, we got... So I think this is a booger one or a pear or something. Yeah. Oh, good. Maybe butter, butter popcorn. I don't know. We'll find out. It's a booger. <laughs> I'm very salty. Ew, mm. gross. Very salty. Oh no, <laughs> booger! Sure, it's a win-win, <laughs> Almighty. <laughs> Almighty, I missed you. I hope you're doing well, my friend. Hope you're doing well. It's true. Basically the same. Welcome in, Hunter! Those that don't know me, I am Dabo Hill. I'm a DVD content creator, killer main, survivor enthusiast. Here having some fun. We're on our first episode of Behind the Fog. Fine, I'll say it. I do love Aaron. I do love Aaron. It's going pretty well. Is one of my best I say friends. so myself. Behind the Fog Very is a late night show. We interview DVD we're content we're creators. We have Jim here. Say. She uh, is amazing. <laughs> Great streamer, great friend of the community. We're just playing some uh, Swift with uh, the community right now. We had our nice little interview earlier. She killed it on one of our games called Sounds of the Fog. Seven for seven on all seven sounds. It's going pretty well, Hunter. Going really, really well. 
We got a no gym. We got to play some fun games. Had a lot of tech issues. Learning like a champ. Hopefully I'm not on mute. That would be horrible. I left this... This odd. <clears throat> Started 30 minutes late because of tech problems. Found out how to work this thing a little bit, though. <laughs> not too oh, hard. Good. After after figure out what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to start your stream first, then go to the stream together. Oh, see, I didn't know that. Well, didn't know that either. <laughs> yeah. Well, it looks like it's a trickster. Oh. It's probably blood favor. Hopefully it's blood favor. Or devour. No scourgy hookies. Starstruck. Yeah, it might be getting adept. No, not blood favor. Um, if they were getting control. adept, it might be crowd control, yeah. Mm hmm. Okay. I'm Hope not going yet. I'm exposed. <laughs> oh, Starstruck, okay. okay. <laughs> Yeah. So I was just outside the range of it. Okay. I hear them. Are they coming back? No, they're not. I'm not gonna heal down here. That's for damn sure. I yeah, I don't heal unless I will make it. Even then, I'm a little iffy. Yeah. <laughs> so He's stuck there. down there too easily. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Then they come out with the achievement where you have to heal in basement. <laughs> it's just kind of funny. Star Strike's hand back. Not enough. Wiggle progress. Oh, I do have enough for a flash ring. Shit. No main event for you, my friend. You get in that locker. You get in that locker. Going back. <laughs> oh, I'm getting drilled with questions. Some good progress, getting a reset, that's all I care about. <laughs> Come on, 1v1ing. I'm definitely gonna 1v1 Hunter when I interview Hunter. I know that much. Oh, I'm, I'll get destroyed by Jim, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> I would definitely get destroyed if you were point killer, though. <laughs> you are so nah. good. I am just a, a baby killer. <laughs> I'm working on it, though. I'm getting more practice and have you to thank for the inspiration. Of course, of course. Yeah. I'm here to help. <laughs> I enjoy okay. helping and teaching and... Doing all the fun things. Okay, three hooks, three gents done. Okay, we need. <clears throat> that one's kicked. Where you at, buddy? You're right there on top of Sam. Okay. 
go. I'll take it. I'm taking aggro. Oh no. You have to get me with your, your thingy. Okay. The, the main event. All right. Oh god. Right he out the window. It scared me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you are. I am way over here. Yeah. That's okay. I haven't knocked yet, so all good. <clears throat> I am a baby oh, killer. <laughs> ghost faces. Good, good what kind of scares you the most? Oh my god, it is definitely Myers. The whole, I'm quiet and I can sneak up on you. I mean, even Ghostface does, but like, there's something about Myers. It's just classic scare. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Can you help me? Alright. Cool. It's good enough there. He'll be taking me back, hook. What a sweet, sweet guy. But Aww, such, a such a gentleman of him. Such a gentleman. Yeah. Sex dungeon and the special hook. I'm jealous. Do we get a Mori? We do not get a Mori. Uh, oh god. I don't remember. Miss the He's on me again. I think you hit that way too early. He likes the shiny neck. Oh, you got me in the last part of it. Good right. Good job. Good job. Which was it going? Let's go. Okay. Did not bring Mori. Did not. Okay, syringing myself. Hunter, how was the stream <clears throat> if you're still here? I know sometimes we got a raid and run, and I completely understand that. Uh oh no, Sam! Oh no! The killer wants the shiny nick super badly. Oh no! Oh god! Oops. I'm dead, dead. It's all good. Shit. He wanted that trophy really badly. That trophy's me. <laughs> oh shit, I'm dead. Yeah. I wasn't paying attention. I forgot about that. Oh good. Shit, shit, shit. Yeah, he went after the both of us mostly. Yeah. Stop it! Oh good. It's turning me on! Stop! Claudette is Adept in... I think no... yeah, maybe. In sync or Backstreet Boys, DJ wants to know? It's a good question. Oh, Backstreet Boys. Always. 
<laughs> I was a huge Backstreet Boys fan and still am. I love them. Nice. <laughs> I love NSYNC too. I, I, I like them both like separately, but if I had to pick, yeah, Backstreet Boys. BSB. Right answer. Yeah. <laughs> That's the right answer. That's a good answer. Get it, get it, get it, get it. There's proxying, yeah, they're proxying. You good for another game or two, Jim? And then I think I'm yeah. going to call it for the night. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. I appreciate I it. This appreciate is so much this. fun doing yeah. this. That was a lot of fun. I'm having so much fun. Ooh, <laughs> I don't want it to end, joke. but you know. <laughs> I know. I agree. It was a lot of fun. I like dad jokes. They're dad fun. jokes are great. Yeah. I know a lot of people don't like them, but I think they're they're funny. They make me laugh. <laughs> I used to lead meetings, a weekly meeting, and I always open up with dad jokes. Yes. Oh my gosh, that's the best. <laughs> What's a good way to start? <clears throat> yeah, they're adapting. Oh, okay. I think they've. Actually, one of my favorite jokes. Uh, I went to the grocery store to get six sprites. Came home with seven up. <laughs> it's stupid, but I love it. It's like funny. <laughs> uh. Uh. <laughs> that was one of my favorites. I don't That's know. It's silly. One. It's stupid, but I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I think Deja doesn't respect me anymore now. <laughs> I don't really know too many though. Like I've heard some, but like I always have trouble like remembering them. But I've heard quite a quite a few good ones. Yeah, adept, you got it. Good for them. Nice. Honestly, good job. Okay, we gotta go shiny. <laughs> and the Nick. cringe, yeah. I don't even cringe. I think they're funny. <laughs> they're always great. Yeah. Okay, let's go survivors. Yeah. <laughs> let's go. Hopefully I don't get tunneled though. We look kind of different enough, though. Yeah. I want his anniversary outfit so badly, though. I cannot wait for the event. <laughs> I was thinking that the whole entire time, Sam. I was like, Sam hates Trickster. You uh, ran good at the end. Sorry, Sam. Okay. I still need to get them up here. So let's just do this here. Oh. Let's go. That's a good question. Hmm. That's a good question. I don't know. I have to think about it. Because, like, obviously you would want somebody who kind of knows, like, a lot of things. Especially, like, random stuff. It's very true. It's true. It's very true. My son, I was talking to him. The other day, and he's like, "Don't you?" He's like, "Don't you work in tech?" I was like, "Kinda, I kind of do." <laughs> I don't know. 
Yeah, I, I'm not sure. I have a lot of friends that are really smart, so it's like, kind of hard to choose. Shiny Nick, shiny Nick. We yes. got us a shiny Nick. I actually need to think of like a theme song. I've been doing it that way because I can't think of anything else, but <laughs> I really, really need a theme song. I got to think of something. If you ask DJ real nicely, he might come up with something. He's very musically inclined. <gasps> DJ. <laughs> I need a shiny Nick song. <laughs> I will, I will definitely commission you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I just, um, I already have a parody song uh, from What You Want uh, called Tiffany Licious, and I absolutely love it instead of Fergalicious. So good. And it's about Tiffany. I love it. But I definitely need a, a Nick song, too. This guy over here has like 15 million instruments <laughs> at his house, loves playing them. If you could completely rework a killer who would be, I, I go back to Leatherface. <laughs> <laughs> Except that wouldn't be a rework. It'd be like changing that the way he works. That'd still be a rework. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. And I guess the second would be like Doctor. I, I don't like the fact that zap, 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 it stops you from doing stuff. I get that you're getting electrocuted, but it's like, it's annoying. <laughs> I'm doing a toad. I'm doing a shiny totem. You stop me from doing it. It's like no. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> I... <laughs> I love you, DJ. <laughs> uh... oh, that's great. It's it's so much fun. Uh, I used to suck at Bubba, and DJ used to always make me play Bubba. Ah. Uh... I don't hate him or anything. I'm just saying. I I don't know. Not not my fave. <laughs> I hate this fog. Yeah. Oh, is that what he said? Yeah, that's what he my He usually said. says that one. Oh. It's a nursey poo. Ah. I hear now. Is that three blinks? It's three blinks, sir. I couldn't <laughs> tell if minute. it's... Sounded reverses. like five blinks. All right. I think she might have the reverse. Hey. Oh, I'm so happy here. <laughs> he's respect true and you know i think another thing too is um some people like to be mean with him and i think that's another reason why i don't always like going against them she has a blink where if you blink through you you'll scream mm -hmm. oh i love that one that was fun ah <laughs> <gasps> goldfish are good Yum. Fear snack. Yeah, I like goldfish. Also kind of like funyuns, they're good. Uh-oh. Gabby's on a mission. I was. I, <sighs> time. I saw it too. I was like, oh gosh. Oh no. I have a flashback. I haven't touched Jin yet. Dang. I should have took a septic. That's what I should have done.
Whoa, okay. Uh, you're talking about reverse? I think so. Yeah. Come on. Come on, baby girl. Oh, she wants you so bad. Never mind. <laughs> okay. Whoa, that was weird. Oh god. Ooh. Uh. Just run over here, freaking. I'm in myself here. <laughs> Nurses? Is that. No. <laughs> wow, well, that's it. Hi. Oh, I hear you. I'm sorry. Hi, Olivia. Uh, hello. I don't, I don't know if I brought a friend. Okay. Oh, you brought a friend. Yeah, I did. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just mending. I did not know you. Oh, God. She's scary. Oh, God. <gasps> oh, I forgot to use my... Shave and a haircut. <laughs> Ooh. Hi. You. Gotta go. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Whoops! I went the wrong way. Damn it! Ah, oh, it's all right. She wants oh. them so bad. She doesn't want them shiny Nickies. Mm-hmm. She wants the prize. Here, I'll come heal you. Hi. Oh, sorry. I was looking to chat. <laughs> oh, no worries. I was like, hello. <laughs> Guys, it's like practically free. I don't even run ads anymore, hardly. Besides when you yeah. first join. Do <laughs> <laughs> you not hear that gin? It's not. I'm gonna go touch. Oh, she's going to the other one. Oh no, she's going to someone. Not someone. Flashbang oh, going here. A friend. Yep. Well, I was trying to finish it, Jen. I'll finish it here in a second. Alright, all good, all good. Uh, she didn't chase me. Just want to get a flashbang here. I, th before... I, I think Jake was trying to finish it. Yeah. 
We saw Jake again. Needs like three more seconds. All right. By the way, no nurse is calling a nurse. Like asp. She has nowhere to hide though. Nice. Got Jin Jin. I mean, I do, Almighty. <laughs> no. Ooh. Flashbang. Possibly has a barbecue. Possibly. That lost attack. <laughs> I know this guy is crazy. <laughs> I'm trying to get you. Oh. That's right, I started to heal. Oh no. Oh no. Sam, no! Okay. Let's see here. Oh god. No, Sam! Damn it. She was trying to go past us, like, hardcore. <laughs> I don't blame them. Ding. Ding them. Shit. I'm not gonna make it. Alright. We tried, Sam. Sorry, Sam. Ooh. Hoping to get uh, sure with that blind. <laughs> <clears throat> I hope he did. That was kind of. It I seemed like it was really well timed. Unforeseen. Okay. Nowhere to hide. Okay. Yeah, I was like, I knew she had that. Okay. Exactly. Okay, we got one more game, guys. I'm going to play, then we're going to raid out. Yeah. And call it a good night. I appreciate <laughs> everyone coming in and hanging out. All the fun quotes and questions. It's been an awesome night. Let me put some points in my bard as well. You know me, guys. That's me. <laughs> Uh. Almost back to having everyone prestige three. <laughs> that's what I was doing too. I'm putting points in the new uh, character. I got him to two, so that's good. Nice. I'm almost to two on them as well. Yeah. Awesome. That's why I'm putting the BPS. Let's go. <clears throat> what up, Pink Kitty Lynn? How are you been? Hopefully you're doing well. Almighty would never. Almighty's a stand-up guy. 
<laughs> Prestige, you get him to level 50. That's awesome. That's what you gotta do. Gotta play all the deebs. We're gonna play even more deebs when, uh, whatchamacallit comes out. When the anniversary event comes out. Which is what, this next week? On the 13th, yeah. Next week. I'm gonna grab my syringe. I should've went for my syringe. We'll go over to... Shiny Nick. <laughs> yes. You're the more cool Nick. Nah. <laughs> you got the shades and everything. <laughs> you got the I'm cool stash. <laughs> I guess. I got the leather pants on too. Oh, that's right, you do. Nice. <clears throat> that's what I usually do. Pink Kitty, Kitty Lynn is just switch back and forth between Killer and Survivor, whoever has the most blood points. I enjoyed uh, Chaos Shuffle uh, when it would be like 150% blood points. I'm like, yep, I'll take that. Oh, I love that too. I would be switching around just for that. Mm -hmm. It was so much fun. I really hope that's something that they'll kind of keep at some uh, point. From That'd be something fun. I saw that they're supposed to keep it, they're going to introduce their yeah? own. <gasps> yeah. That'd be great. I mean, I, I kind of like it just once in a while. Like, obviously not all the time, but like once in a while, it's really fun to do something like have perks that you normally don't even run. It's, it's really I cool. wish they would just let me do that in normal mode. Like, just put red perks out all the time because I would do that. Mm. Yeah, but I think the mechanics probably it needs to be separate. Kind of like, yeah. you know, the lights out and stuff too. Yeah, probably. Favorite DBD <clears throat> chapter, Jim? Ooh. Well, I mean, Huntress was my first um, chapter. She was kind of a chapter, I guess. It was. I think yeah. it was just her, though. Um, Chucky, yeah. <laughs> like, I, still I really enjoy Chucky. Ch like, I love Chucky. <laughs> yeah, Chucky. I just, uh, yeah, again, the whole third person is just so much fun. I love it. Nick Cage won his own chapter, but you know, he should have been his own chapter. <laughs> mm -hmm. Have you found the Tanuki? I have. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I always say that. Oh, there's a shiny here. Crow lady. It glows, it goes. Who would win? Jason Reich Myers. Ooh. <clears throat> That's a good question. I want to say Michael Myers. I mean, Jason's pretty strong too, but. Yeah. I don't know what that was, but it gone now. Mm. Hopefully, come this way. Oh no. They don't have enough time. Oh, they, they're, they're going. Bye. <clears throat> oh, they're still committing to him, too. That's crazy. Might be coming back. No. They're not. They're committing. How did that hit me? <laughs> she has blindness on the birds.
Oh boy. Yeah, that's like where I was like, won't they? Aren't they both like can't be killed or hard to kill? Yeah, they're both kind of the same and kinda. What? Yeah. What? That's right to you guys, I think. Yep. Oh my gosh, stop hitting me with the burbs. I don't know. I'm... Pennywise got killed by some kids, didn't he? <laughs> I I'm not sure what Fung wants from me. <laughs> She's following me around like a little puppy. <laughs> little puppy. Little puppy doggy. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's far away. <coughs> Thank you, Samuel. Oh. Tinker? Question mark? She had no terror radius. I think so. Arms were seen. One of those. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> I fell down. Hey, we got it done done. I wanted the family home was almost done, but yeah. Still so going back to it though. <clears throat> okay. Let's move on over here real fast. Yeah, it's definitely coming back. You good over there with your med kit, or you need some hills? Nope. <laughs> it's all good. Oh, never mind. She went after Sam. Oh, gosh. Hey. I only healed a tiny bit. <laughs> no, Sam. Thank you. Damn it. And then my background player. Damn. Coming right into main. It's fine. You forget, I'm Nick Cage. <laughs> mm -hmm. I cannot get this done, though. Ghostbusters? I'm gonna lure away. The building was almost done. Jen and, uh... Okay. They're over there. Never mind, she didn't chase me. Never mind, she is. I lied. <laughs> oh gosh, what does she have? She has a pop. She might have pop. 
Because it was like 90% done. At least. Yeah, she might have pop. Tinker pop. Sending birds over there. I think. I think she has uh, something that makes you exhausted. So I think the bird one from Vecna. She has a blindness one for the birds, too. Oh. <laughs> Your microphone isn't working, you need a tech guy. Um, I call one of my friends for sure. Oh, Dabby, Dabby's good with tech stuff. <laughs> Why are you shaking your head no at me, Fong? What did I do to you? It's good. I was shit. No, 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 no. <laughs> what are you doing? No! I'm pretty sure one of them's a tech guy in Ghostbusters. Yeah, I believe The new so. Gus Ghostbusters, there's the girl that's a tech girl. Right. I mean, that's kind of how they came about with the, the blasters and whatever. I can't I wait for 2v8. On... Oh, alright, she's, she's on me on again. You? I'm dead, dead. Oh, shit. <clears throat> She wants a shiny nick, what can I say? Also, not an artist main, keeps throwing three birds every single time. <laughs> I don't know, man, the cooldown's a lot but lot longer. Oh, God. I don't know, man. I'm not an artist main, but you know. <laughs> New DVD mode you'd like to see. I mean, I kind of already saw it, the randomizer. I really enjoy that. Actually, maybe like a, a randomizer for a killer. That'd be kind of funny. You know, like who who am I gonna be this match? Yeah, <laughs> that'd be kind of fun. That's what I, I wish they would have done possible. for the randomizer. Is like everything gets random. Your your killer, your freaking perks, your outfit. Yeah, your something. Add-ons. That would be that'd cool. That'd be cool. Like everything randomized. That'd be kind of fun. That one, that one down. Engine down there. Just got back to this gin over here. Have I played D D? No. I have actually never played. I I've seen people play it like on streams, but I've never actually played. Baldur K3, no, I have not. I have friends who play it, but I, I have not. <laughs> oh. Yeah, she's doing the burbs. There she was. Yeah. I'm missing out? I bet I am. I, yeah. I just, I've never played. Well, this gate three is a lot of fun. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Nice. It really is. I just, I've never played D&D. I'd be probably Oh, I never played D&D. &D, <laughs> I still loved it. It just takes yeah? a little bit oh, okay. to get used to the mechanics of the game. But the story right. is so much fun. There's so much stuff to do. Oh, okay. Oh. Dead, dead. The Nick Cages are dead, dead. Nick Cages are dead, dead. Mm -hmm. Do you have anyone online that you would like to raid out to? Oh, let me see. Uh... Ooh. Um, somebody who stopped by earlier is lurking because they're actually streaming. <laughs> Lord Grapefruit. Lord Grapefruit. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Let's go 
really, really chill guy. Playing Huntress. Wants to be Huntress main, so. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah. Usually Survivor main, but been playing Huntress, and I'm so proud of him. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys for coming in. I appreciate it. You guys are amazing. Jim, thank you so much for a wonderful first episode. I really thank you. It. Mm -hmm, me too. All the tech issues and everything. It was a blast. <laughs> we gotta do some stuff like this again. I enjoy yes. playing with you. I enjoy playing with you. Let me know. <laughs> I'm down. <laughs> um, thank you, guys. everybody. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go enjoy some uh, Huntress. You guys have a wonderful evening. I will talk to you soon. I will get another episode coming up soon, maybe in a couple weeks, and uh, let's have some fun. Thanks, everyone.